Ready. Ready to fight. All right, so lofty expectations for this matchup as round one gets underway. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but on the other, truly a fighter who can do it all. And that guy will usually have the advantage on paper. When you're a striker at this guy's level, that will normally balance out whatever advantage the other guy has. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Well, really using his reach advantage there with that punch, DC. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection. Whoa! He was hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh! Oh, he might be out. Straight punch, knocked his head in the wrong direction. Really putting his opponent on notice. Three minutes remain in the round. Ooh, head kick lands and he's hurt. Ooh wee, ooh wee, what a right hand by this young man. Hands higher, hands higher. Swing and a miss with that straight left hand. Sneaky head kick. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Oh, effective strike there by Lee. Lands flush with that right hand. Just out of range with that right hand. Hip over when he throws that kick. Just misses there with the left. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Just misses with the left hook. Nice head kick. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Ooh, blocks the shot. Oh, an educated jab there. I can Whoa! Entertaining scrap so far. Check out some of the action from that previous round, DC. Head kicks upon head kicks, man. I mean, generally, you don't take this many head kicks. Right. You get one, and you go to sleep. But he's been able to withstand it. But I'm telling you, man, he takes one more, and he takes one more clean. His night's over. You ready to fight? Ready. Good. Oh, head kick blocked by Lee. Can't take many of those. You better check. Connects with a right. Oh, beautiful jab by him there, really taking advantage of what is an obvious edge and reach. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Nice body shot. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, <laughs> if you're gonna sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand. Jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man, let this guy have the whole thing. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. Huge block there. 
Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. Back and forth we go here. Liver kick. If you take those kicks, it's going to shut your body off. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Look at the whip action that comes to him. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. He's looking to land the right just out of range. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Back to the jab now. No good. Ooh, big shot lands. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Just missed with the left there. And that's the end of round number two. All right, well, his kicking game was outstanding in that round. We'll see if his opponent can make the adjustments, but take us through the replays before we get there. It's always weird to watch a young fighter start to come into his own. Early in his career, he did not have this ability. He did not have the ability to dictate and control fights with his legs. Now he does, and he looks like a future champion Good. in the making. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round, and at some point, these are going to really start to take their toll. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick, and watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight IQ. That one snuck in. Nice strike. Nice sneaky head kick. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. That strike blocked by Lee. He missed with that jab attempt there. Well, missed on that one. How about that chin? Oh, he landed a beautiful straight punch there, DC. He's got an edge in reach and certainly is making it count in this one. And he's looking for that left hand, just missed. We march on three minutes to go. Nice punch, man. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting them up now. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. <laughs> Lee gets hit by that kick to the midsection. You got to do better defensively. Man, it doesn't take a lot of these kicks to produce redness. Look at the left side of his body there. Nasty. Nice straight punch. Missed with that right hand. Oh, look at that jab, snapped his head back. His jab gets to the target so fast, and he always brings his hands right back to his face. Oh, he hurt it bad with the jab. Whoa! Whoa! He didn't like that left hand. Oh, that couldn't have felt good as he lands the knee to the body. He's a tall fighter, and he's going to have the size advantage against most opposition in this division. And he landed the right hand there. He gets tagged with a kick now. Let's see if he can wrap. And both guys really throwing with authority. Thirty seconds now to go in the round. What a punch! Stuns him beautifully with the left hand. The left hand is so accurate. 
is so educated, he's so able to fight from both fighting stances. All right, so there's the end of the round, and on one side, thrill on the other, agony after that knockdown. Yeah, he was able to really damage him with that big punch. You see the hands, the speed, how sharp he is, how technical he is. It allows him to land in spots where his opponent is winging Where's punches. Fight? Great strike Where? landed, great punch landed to put his opponent down. Nice punch lands over the top. Lee gets caught by that straight punch. His defense has abandoned him tonight. Oh, Superman punch. Look at the turn in that kick. Oh, that straight punch was useful, champ. Multiple times, he's used this punch to get to the target. Oh, and he connects there. His hands look good tonight. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. Well, you can just see he is oozing with confidence and not overconfidence, but a big knockdown in round one, likely the source of that confidence. Once everything is going great, you tend to feel like you can walk through a wall. He doesn't need to walk through a wall. He needs to continue to find the right avenues to land those shots. Oh, found a home for that knee. Oh, beautifully placed in time kick there by Lee. Timely defense there, huge block for him. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Big punch lands. Ooh. Under two minutes to go. Lee gets caught by the straight punch. Oh! Serve him up. Go get him. Oh! He's in trouble. He's getting lit up. They're going at it now. Good stick. Unable to connect with the right. Under a minute to go. Another shot lands upstairs. Head kick attempt, it's blocked. Hands high, hands high. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Oh, looked like that left hand found the target. Found the target, as it has on so many occasions tonight. Buzzer sounds for the end of round four, 20 minutes in the books. Well, I'm not sure the extent to which he has recovered, but we do see the end of the round. DC, talk us through the replay. Well, he's a tough guy. He's going to make it to the stool. He's going to survive unless you put him completely out of there. Unfortunately, he's in there with a guy that does have that ability. You ready to fight? Ready. Fifth and final round. Oh, well done to block that powerful kick to the body. Big head kick. Trying to establish that jab once again. Good punch. Able to check that kick as well. Back to the well with that right hand. It's no good. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. <laughs> Trying to hammer that lead leg. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad.
Oh, and he lands a punch there. Good connection by him on that. Great connect, so fast, so accurate. Watch the ability to land from anywhere. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Wow! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh, he might be out. Nice punch lands over the top. Checks the leg kick. Hands higher, hands higher. There's no tell on that leg kick. Ooh, looking to set up the head kick, but he misses. All right, well, it's late in the fight. Time is of the essence, and when you're clearly losing and you know you need a finish, risk management goes out the window. Oh, yeah. No more risk management. Either get knocked out or you knock him out. One way or the other, you're gonna lose. You can lose by decision, or you can lose by knockout. But at least when you go for the knockout, you give yourself a chance to try to find your shot. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Whoa! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Don't finish his fight. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Great punch landed with so much power. Look at him drive his shin and the body with that body kick. Nice leg kick. Sniff that one out as he blocks the kick. What a fight! 